So we have common planning time. Um, all of the teachers on the 4 or 5 team get together, and so we talk about um, how we're going to plan for the use of this data. Um, I give an entrance ticket every day in my math class, and we sort of take that entrance ticket and we determine who's mastered the concept, who needs to come to seminar to review the concept, who needs, who's ready to move on and can go on to the next um, sort of lesson. So we look at data during class. We'll take data from an exit ticket and examine who understood the concept, who needs a review for the next day, and we'll do that during our common planning time. Um, we look at program data, so here we use a program called STMath and a program called Lexia, and it gives us data um, real-time right away so we can determine who we need to pull, um, who's struggling on a certain concept, or who is working really fast and we can push a little bit further. Um, so we look at sort of that formative data beforehand, the data during class, who's struggling, who do I need to stop my seminar for and give a review. Um, and then we look at that exit data to determine who's ready to move on for next time. So we started this in October. And from October until now, I think we only kind of normaled out the last couple of months. We started in October grouping and regrouping kids every single day. And we realized that kids weren't showing up to sessions and they weren't getting what they needed to get done done and I think it was because they were overwhelmed and their feedback to us was we're doing too much and I don't know where to go. So we adjusted it from there to us actually grouping the students and then them grouping themselves a little bit based on their exit slips and still the feedback from them was we're overwhelmed, we don't know what to do, could you help us a little bit more and so from that we now came up with these groups and so it's been a process since the beginning of the year. We started this about a month into the school year and it's only finally what it is now in the last month or so. And you can um, it's been really important to have shared collaborative planning time. Mm -hmm. And so we have specific days that are dedicated for just that mm -hmm. in the week. And we also have um, specific times during prep that we um, arrange meetings to mm -hmm. talk about those things. Um, and they're like weekly, daily. Mm -hmm. um, it's really nice to be like on sub, such a collaborative team because yeah. um, these students are shared students. Yeah. So a lot of my students might see Kelly or the first grade teacher or mm -hmm. the special ed teacher. So we're taking a shared responsibility. Mm -hmm. um, so it's really important that we're meeting all the time to make sure mm -hmm. that students are getting what they need mm -hmm. um, because right. we are sharing those test scores and we're, yeah. we want every student um, to get exactly mm -hmm. what they need. 